So this is my case right here. It, as you can see, let me try to zoom out. I'm sorry for the bad lighting. I don't really, really have good lighting in my house. But the case is pretty clean. I mean, is it the cleanest case? No, but for the most part, it's a pretty clean clay. Uh, excuse me, I can't talk. It's a pretty clean case. And this thing burnt out. I don't know if the power supply shorted itself. I don't know if the motherboard. I don't know what the hell. I did have problems with the motherboard in the past. And I sent it in the uh, MSI to get fixed. And they said there was nothing wrong with it. I just didn't have something set up right. I don't know if that's entirely true. Either way, this thing just shorted. And it could have destroyed my hard drive. My 2 terabyte hard drive right there. It could have it probably ruined that graphics card right there. It's a kind of a cheapo graphics card. It's a 4... 84 gigabyte uh, My motherboard like the CPU and the motherboard are the most expensive parts in this But I'm just I'm really pissed uh, my sound card down there might be destroyed too Everything in here might be destroyed. It smells it stinks. I don't know who's who's gonna cover this I don't have the money to fucking like just buy new parts. This shit is like 700 maybe 900 dollars of parts in here mostly from the RAM the 16 gigabytes of DDR4 RAM uh, there, there, the Corsair one, uh, right there, those two slots, it, it stinks, it smells bad, I don't know what's not working now, but the whole thing reeks, obviously I unplugged it, but this thing was on fire, I don't know why, like, it not fire, fire per se, I don't know if it's the right term, but it was smoking, oh, and up there's my DVD drive, uh, my DVD Blu-ray drive right there, that's just a DVD Blu-ray reader, but if any of these parts are destroyed, who the hell covers this? Who the hell covers this? And I didn't do anything wrong. I'm pretty sure I didn't do anything wrong. Unless somebody can point out to something I did wrong. All I did was turn the computer on and then it just freaking smoked. I don't understand that. Everything was connected right. I had these, uh, excuse me, I had the, I had this plugged in. The graphics, what is that? PCE links, these are the, here they are. Yeah. See, the lighting's just so bad in my house. Either way, I, I'm really frustrated right now. There's the lighting. Look, my case is pretty damn clean. I have the fan right there. Most of the time when I run my computer case too, I have that open when I'm doing something. Like if I'm, if I'm upscaling a video or if I'm playing a video game, sometimes I have that open because I'm trying to get the cold air to come in. And the reason I don't have two fans set up in the front is because it gets really loud when I have two fans set up. And also, this motherboard, from day one, I did not like this B450 Tomahawk Max because sometimes when I had CPU fans plugged in, it wouldn't work. And I explained that to uh, MSI. MSI, who haven't really been... I haven't really gotten along with MSI because I've been having issues with a lot of other things. They didn't honor the rebates and stuff. Well, they did. They eventually honored it, but... It, MSI has just given given me a headache and now that their parts are messed up Do I really think they're gonna be the type of company they honor their anything? No, I don't I'm just I'm frustrated. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. I Mean I do have a backup computer. I'm using right now. I have an i4 5 6 70 K upstairs But this is this is messed up. This is this is supposed to be my baby. This is supposed to be my main computer and it's not working, and I don't know how what I'm what what's gonna happen. How I'm gonna be reimbursed, or if I'm gonna reimburse at all. I'm frustrated. I'm angry. My parts are not working. I don't think they're gonna work. I mean, they smell. It smells like burnt electronics. I'm very freaking frustrated. This is expensive hardware in here. This case, this gaming case, was expensive when I bought it. But I actually got a deal, and I think I paid 120 for this uh 680C. Uh, this case is a pretty nice looking case, but the problem with this case is that the uh, the cooling in it is pretty bad That's why I always usually have that open I mean that of course they kind of did a crap job at making this case because it just it doesn't doesn't get enough cool air in it Unless you have that open that's stupid and I, I always usually have that open so I know that's That's not the reason why this smoked. It's got to be something related to the power supply EVGA 600 watt power supply or the motherboard probably that I've already had issues with in the past one of these, either MSI's motherboard or the EVJ power supply, one of them just destroyed my computer with expensive parts in it. I'm frustrated. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. Do I got to contact MSI? I don't even get along with MSI. I don't like MSI. I've had issues with them.
And they did eventually honor their $20 crappy gift card rebate, which is ridiculous. It would have been better just for a $20 check. I guess I'm not sure if a company's going to actually do that. I'm not sure if they can allow to send you a check. But either way, it just that was like pulling a teeth just to get a rebate from uh, another graphics card. Not this one. I was uh, It was another graphics card I ordered. Uh, thank God I didn't have the better graphics card in here at the time of this happened. I mean, if it was a better one, it would have fried it. I don't know. Somebody in the comment section, tell me what I'm supposed to do. And Pew, this stinks, Pew. Angel, fairy, whatever. It stinks. This stinks. This is the good computer. This is the one I like to stream movies on for you when I'm on uh, Twitch. And I can't even... Well, I, I could do it with the i4 six seven k upstairs too but it, it was better in this one because it has a better cpu and motherboard but the cpu and motherboard on this is probably fried expensive parts the cpu was probably when i bought it maybe like 340 330 bucks that's after taxes the motherboard was probably i don't even remember what the mother motherboard was the motherboard was not cheap though it might have been like 130 140 i might have got a deal on it i don't none of these parts are cheap 75 80 dollars for the ram like it's just this is a lot of money and with the prices of all electronics, I mean, with computer parts going up lately, thank you, government. With the computer parts going up lately, I don't know how that's any of that's going to work. Like, even if uh, MSI or freaking EVJ writes me a check or something like that, whoop de doo what, How much is that check going to really help me out if a lot of these computer parts are going up in price lately? I don't want to check. I mean, I'm, maybe I need replacement parts or something like that. Maybe they can do that. I don't know. I'm frustrated. This is crazy. How the hell does a computer just burn out? Look how clean my computer is. That is pretty clean. That is pretty clean. I'm, I don't have the best lighting, as I said. My house stinks for lighting. But you, as you can see, everything in here is set up pretty damn good. There is nothing in here I should try uh, cause a fire hazard or just the electronics just to burst. And sometimes some people's uh, hardware gets like I've seen uh, videos online where I don't know what the hell is wrong. I don't know if they had something set up or something. But I've seen computers actually literally catch on fire. This didn't catch on fire, but it did smoke. And I'm pretty sure shit is ruined in here. Damn it! 